SpaceX and Elon Musk have envisioned a future for Starship. We're having a thousand spacecraft along with hundreds of launch pads and conducting dozens of launches per day is entirely commonplace. However, they undoubtedly cannot do without massive factory complexes encompassing all rocket production processes. To be honest, even the construction of the Star Factory alone, spanning hundreds of square meters, is not sufficient for the scale that SpaceX is aiming for. Therefore, the gateway to Mars continues to leave its mark in South Texas with numerous multi-million dollar projects. Among these, the standout project confirmed by Elon Musk is the construction of a large-scale five-story complex in South Texas valued at $100 million at the Starbase Complex in Brownsville. So, what does the project mean for the future of SpaceX? It truly goes beyond just the $100 million limit and exceeds what even we think. Let's find out in today's episode of Alpha Tech. The latest project, simply called SpaceX Starbase Office, will see the construction of an industrial complex that would be large enough to fit 15 football fields. To compare, this will be a fourth of the size of Boeing's largest structure, where they built massive 777s at over 4 million square feet. Details filed with the Texas Department of Licensing and Regulation shed light on the project's scope. According to SpaceX's filings, the project will be located at 52190 San Martin Boulevard in Brownsville, a few miles from the launch site, as noted in a report from Valley Central. The proposed development will include the addition of an expanded office mezzanine spanning over 329,000 square feet, strategically integrated with a dedicated industrial factory for the production, development, and launch of Starship rockets, covering approximately 1 million square feet of existing space. Scheduled to kick off this month, the construction will take place near Boca Chica Beach along the Gulf of Mexico's South Bay, which is an ambitious one-year turnaround. The project is anticipated to commence on February 23rd with a targeted completion date of January 1st, 2025. Though it's important to note that all the Texas Department of Licensing and Regulations filings are subject to change. Elon Musk has confirmed the project on X. According to the CEO of SpaceX, the construction of the SpaceX Starbase office valued at $100 million is already well underway. The $100 million allocated for this project marks the most significant building block undertaken in the name of space exploration technologies in Cameron County. However, their ambitions are certainly not limited to this. Elon Musk envisions even greater things, as he has previously declared to the public. In March 2021, Musk proclaimed on social media that he'd rename the area near Boca Chica Beach, creating the city of Starbase, Texas, he said. From thence to Mars and hence the stars, he added that the city will encompass an area much larger than Boca Chica. That's why constructing a $100 million office is a step for SpaceX to gradually strengthen its presence in the Rio Grande Valley of Texas. The company is actively working to officially rename the Brownsville and Boca Chica areas to Starbase, utilizing this area for rocket testing, satellite launches into orbit, and ambitious missions to Mars. SpaceX previously pitched a potential land swap deal to acquire 43 acres of adjacent state park land and plans to construct a $15 million retail center nearby. With these initiatives, the creation of Starbase Texas may be on the horizon. The outcome of this land transaction is still under discussion, with a public announcement scheduled for March. However, if SpaceX succeeds, it'll be a lucrative deal, providing them with a tremendous advantage. Upon examination of the map, it becomes evident that the expanded land in the production site, although somewhat scattered, is substantial, nearly half the size of the existing production site. This expansion extends northeast from the former Boca Chica village, presenting SpaceX with numerous possibilities. The increased space offers SpaceX the opportunity to explore options such as expanding production systems, incorporating areas for rings, or completing prototypes similar to the Sanchez site. They could also develop new production and assembly systems such as bays or star factories. Furthermore, the new land area could be utilized for housing systems for employees given its proximity to the Boca Chica village. Regarding the launch site, the extended land will enable a significant expansion to the west, connecting with the suborbital tank farm and suborbital launch pads. This expansion effectively doubles the size of the current launch site, providing ample room for growth. This expansion opens up significant opportunities for enhancing testing and launching systems, with launch towers being a primary focus. While there is speculation about the construction of a second launch tower in the Pad A, Pad B areas, the expanded space allows for the possibility of multiple launch towers and additional structures. Additionally, the new land may support the development of a new tank farm system to meet the fuel demands associated with testing and launch activities. 
Beyond these key structures, there's anticipation for other innovative plans from SpaceX. Specific details will likely emerge from updates provided by Elon Musk and the SpaceX team in the future. Alongside SpaceX's initiatives, officials from Cameron County and the nearby city of Brownsville have voiced official support for recognizing Starbase as an official location. The Development Corporation's resolution notes that SpaceX's growth in South Texas has a tremendous positive impact on job creation and economic growth in the region to the direct benefit of the residents of Cameron County. Beyond the numbers, it's said that the company's operations there have captured the attention of the nation and the world in connection with space exploration. The resolution also points out that there is no other starbase in the state, nor is the name associated with another zip code. We're with you guys. Nick Serafi, chairman of the Spaceport Development Corporation, said the resolution echoed a similar resolution passed last year by the Cameron County Commissioner's Court. It pretty much just says, we're with you guys. Whatever you need to do, we're happy to support it, he said. Serafi has been involved in the county spaceport development since before SpaceX landed at Boca Chica Beach. The rise of Starship and Starbase has been phenomenal, way beyond expectations, he said. Brownsville Mayor John Cohen also voiced the city's support in a letter to the U.S. Board on Geographic Names, a part of the U.S. Geological Survey. Locals use the name Starbase as it reflects the enthusiasm for this area as the frontier of space exploration, where rockets will be launched to the moon and Mars, he wrote. That's why expanding Starbase is incredibly important. It's an indispensable part of the development process for the Starship project. The launch site, production site, and Massey test site are integral components driving the advancement of Starship. As the project enters a new phase marked by increased production, testing, and launch activities, the ongoing expansion of the production site is paramount. Demolition of old structures has made way for the larger bays and the completion of the highly anticipated Star Factory, set to revolutionize rocket production and automation. Elon Musk's ambitious goals of producing 100 to 300 starships annually by the end of 2023 necessitates a significant overhaul of the production system. The expansion of facilities, particularly in this newly acquired area, is the initial step in meeting these ambitious targets. As SpaceX sets its sights on Mars colonization, a robust housing system becomes essential to accommodate the influx of employees and engineers. Constructing new houses ensures that the workforce can support the project's growth. Looking toward the launch site, the expansion promises to impact future launch plans significantly. With plans to launch thousands of Starships annually and achieve a Starship launch every day, SpaceX acknowledges the need for additional launch towers. A second tower is already in progress, but the scale of their ambitions hints at the potential need for even more towers in the future to meet demand. As launch frequency increases, so does the demand for fuel, necessitating the establishment of new tank farm systems. The existing system may face challenges with the construction of additional launch towers, indicating a need for larger tank farms in strategic locations. In summary, SpaceX's expansion of Starbase is not just a choice but a necessity to accommodate these ambitious goals. By enhancing production, testing, and launch capabilities, SpaceX aims to propel the Starship project to new heights. With significant milestones on the horizon, this strategic advancement prepares SpaceX for the challenges and opportunities that lie ahead in the pursuit of space exploration and colonization. That's all for today's episode. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.